Welcome back. back. Hey there. Uh, we have more food and music and all kinds of live entertainment happening this weekend at MGCCC, Harrison County. Yeah, Just right up to, the road. Yeah, I'm here to talk about it. Uh, Impact Live is what they're calling it. We have instructor Bailey Altman and student Dustin Ross. Thanks to both of you for being with us on the show today. A very quick plug because Karen and I both are in love with the Impact Center. Mm -hmm. I mean, it is just an incredible facility for a concert or it is. anything. I mean, the sound system, yeah. the state, I mean, everything it's, about it. It's a real lighting, gem it's here on fantastic. the coast. And does that mean that, um, Bailey, this is a way to kind of support the Impact Center? It is. It's more of a, um, it's a showcase for my students to kind of represent what I teach them there. So we'll do the sound and the lighting. And people can also enjoy viewing the beautiful Impact Center while they're there, meet my students, and kind of see what we teach for that program. And Dustin, are you one of those students? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> I'm actually one of the people performing uh, on the stage as well. Great. What performing. are you going to be doing? Singing? Uh, I uh, play playing guitar. A guitar? Oh. Yes, ma'am. Okay. But the student part, you're learning lighting and sound? Yes, sir. Through uh, Gulf Coast Community Yes, College? sir. All, anything live entertainment we're learning. Um, before my band gets on stage, I'll be helping set up the sound, uh, produce the sound, all that good stuff. Well, that's going to be a great future. Yes, that sir. is great. I'm, and Bailey, what do you so teach exactly? What's your specialty? Uh, well, I teach them mostly live sound, studio sound, and any kind of theatrical lighting or outdoor lighting. Hmm. Um, but we teach everything. They learn maintenance and law and all kinds of stuff. You know, when they first stuff. opened it, I went over there and did a story, Karen. I, we mm -hmm. walked backstage, and I think some of the students were there working on the equipment and everything. Mm -hmm. You've got some first-class equipment back there, so these students are really getting an opportunity to learn about professional stuff. Yes, yeah, so they are. Yeah. What do you enjoy about performing there, uh, Dustin? I imagine you've performed on that stage, or have you not yet? Uh, not on the auditorium, but uh, we've set up in the black box for the Red Radio Talent Nights and their um, their uh, black box series that they do. Right. Um, for the Talent Nights, my band's got up there and played, and we've enjoyed every second of it. It's, yeah, that's it's, exciting. What, what are you going to be performing? What, are you, what kind of song what are you going to uh, be doing? We're actually going to be doing a lot of original stuff and a few cover songs. You say we have a band? Yes, sir. Oh, cool. Uh, I have a little three-piece band. That's cool. nice. And um, I know you love getting your students involved in this way, right? For something like this. It's mm -hmm. a free event on the lawn out there, so people should yes. bring. Well, tell me a little bit about what people can expect. So it's, it is a free event out on the lawn. Um, people need to bring their own chairs, blankets, you know, anything they want to have to keep cool. Um, but essentially it's for, it's for kids and families. So we're going to have kids activities. We'll have painting. We'll have a gaming truck and we'll have vendors, food trucks, and Coca-Cola is going to be selling some drinks. So it's just going to be a good afternoon on the lawn. And, nice. And, and, and Bailey, are you, the college is making a big commitment really to this program, these, these particular... Yes, uh, the college has backed us yeah. all the way to let us do this. And it's going to be an amazing first year. We're hoping to do it annually if it goes well. Um, and yeah, they've, they've been fully supportive. It's been awesome. Yeah, what kind of music uh, does your band play? I know you said uh, you do some covers. Yes, ma'am. We do mainly rock and alternative kind of stuff. Um, the other bands that are going to be there, we're going to have a wide variety of stuff. we got a Titus Gillard, he's a blues player. Um, Katie Jones, she does country. Tristan Elise, he does country. And the Sugar Cane Duo, they do a mixture of everything as oh, well. Nice. Okay, well there you go. So if you're looking for something to do, I would suggest um, Friday at... <laughs> I was waiting for the graphic <laughs> up there. I, I think so. I had no idea when it was. Uh, Friday <laughs> at 5 o'clock. Uh, there is no admission charge. I, I've been told it's family friendly and it's a lawn chair event. Yeah, and all of those bands too. So uh, how long do you expect this to go to? From uh, five until about nine. nine. Well, good luck, okay? Thank, Thank you. you. And thanks for being with us on Thank the 4 o'clock show. That sounds great. Thank you. Thank you.